I'll show you a couple different things that I do in my training. I use this, obviously it's inflated, so it's a different, uh, it's a different surface than the ground, obviously. This is my uh, 12th year professional and staying in the weight room, uh, make sure my flexibility is good, make sure my strength is good. Um, these are all things that, you know, it's not just about, people think that basketball is just about going into the gym and, and getting shots up, but it's a multi-dimensional, multi-body uh, functional thing that you need to do. Being able to land and stay with my core, um, with my core tight and not being able to move and, and then also being able to push and land on a, on a solid surface, uh, which kind of gives you two different types of uh, landing. It's not just about uh, overall just, just you know, brute strength. Um, it is about being able to have the strength in your legs to be going full speed and be able to stop on a dime. You know, strength in the weight room is, is really important. It's a long season. I like to do this in the summer. I like to do this before the games, uh, just to kind of get my legs flowing. It's, it's a lot of this is, uh, you know, timing as well as uh, explosiveness and being able to really be able to push off of a dime as quick as possible. You know, this is the main thing of trying to be as quick as you can and whichever moments and, and movements you are doing. The lat pull down, you want to have good posture and being able to use your, your lats, your back to be able to keep a, a solid base. Everybody has their own kind of routine. That's the main thing, be able to do the same thing, be able to eat the same thing, be able to go to sleep, you know, uh, trying to go to sleep at the right time. So this is all kind of goes hand in hand. So this is a, an exercise I like to do, kind of get the blood flowing as well. Get your, your lats, your shoulders going. In basketball, being able to I'm playing a uh, power forward position, so being able to uh, withstand a lot of these contact and it's good, it's good for your shoulders as well. The recovery part is just as important as being in that moment of actually training. I think, uh, you know, being able to refuel your body, you know, within an hour of you training, I think this is, uh, this is the main thing. A TRX row. Like I said, there's different ways that you could do it. I like to use it as a stretch at first, especially after this lat pull down. I kind of like to open up the, the shoulders a little bit. Basketball players, we're a little bit taller than most people. Um, you know, our, our, our limbs need rest, especially being, uh, you know, myself being, you know, 6'8", being able to, you know, bounce back, trying to bounce back as fast and recover as fast as possible. I'm trying to do, Stability, I'm trying to do um, strength, mobility, flexibility, um, but mostly just core. Basketball is a lot about core. It's a lot about uh, being able to, if you're knocked off balance, being able to hold this spot. Um, and so all of these little training things I showed you helps with this.